All right, what's up? Uh, so I read, this is my third vlog. I read chapter six to 10 on Sense and Sensibility. Uh, getting a little better understanding of, of the story in general. So a quick recap of what happened was um, the Lady Dashwoods, the Dashwood ladies, I mean, they moved into their new home where they were um, approached, not approached, but uh, where they found uh, Sir John Middleton, who is uh, Mrs. Dashwood's cousin. So he's like the landowner. So he's the one that gave him the home and stuff. So right there, we're introduced to him. And then we're also introduced to his wife, um, Lady Middleton. She's very reserved and reticent, kind of the opposite of what he is. And um, yeah, then they invite them to dinner. They go eat dinner. And then we're introduced to Lady Middleton's mother, Mrs. Jennings. And then we're also introduced to another guy, um, Colonel Brandon. So we also see that they don't really have a lot of, a, they're not really affiliated with a lot of people. So we see how they're kind of like a boring family and stuff like that. You get me? So that happens. And then um, Colonel Brandon, he grows, mm, I guess, like an admiration. He begins to like uh, Marianne. Um, so that happens. And then later down uh, the line, I think Marianne and Margaret, they just want to go uh, walk around the hills and stuff. And then. Marianne trips and like something she twists I think she twists her ankle and then she's picked up by a guy and then we find out that that guy is Willoughby and he takes her back home um and then she uh Marianne and Eleanor begin to talk about um like what has happened and stuff so right there then that, that that's where that's where it ends um but what we can get from that is Willoughby in this case is Wickham connecting to Pride and Prejudice. And, uh, what's the other dude's name? Colonel Brandon is Darcy. Um, in these chapters, we begin to see how the, the motives behind these girls and the way they view things. Um, Eleanor is a lot more uh, emotionally connected to people. She sees past their appearance and past the materialistic things and their money and what they have and sees like their true character. While Marianne is a lot more appearance based that if you're ugly and stuff then she won't like you. If you're handsome then she will. Um, so then she has like she only sees the front that people place. That's why she's a lot more attracted to Willoughby because they share more things in common. They're both um, really I guess affected by appearance and stuff. And then Brandon, Colonel Brandon is more he's trying to connect to Marianne in an intimate level. But she's trying to she's just ignoring him because that's not how she views things. So with that. We begin to see how these characters are um, constructed, characterized. And then we also see that, I guess, hold up, I'm moving over here because I look ugly. Um, we also see how Austin characterizes uh, Colonel Brandon as a very sensible man, while Willoughby is characterized by his um, high sensibility. So that's another reason why I guess you can pair those two. We can pair Eleanor and Colonel Brandon and Willoughby with, um, what's her name, Marianne. Um, I feel that the relationship that Marianne is going to have with Willoughby is going to be short-lived, kind of like uh, Elizabeth was with Wickham. She's going to find out, I guess, a truth about it, uh, about who he really is. And in turn, she's going to develop feelings for um, Colonel Brandon. Colonel Brandon already likes her, but she doesn't really feel anything towards him. Uh, so we'll see how that develops later on. Maybe that, that's going to play a, a key role in the in the plot development. And uh, and yeah, so far we're seeing Marianne develop how her sensibility gets in the way of things, how her judgment is clouded by appearance, um, while Eleanor sees past things like that and uh, focuses on, on who a person truly is. So yeah, we, we, we also begin to see, I think, what Austin is trying to show is how the materialistic things and wealth and inheritance, because the story is really based upon inheritance and money and wealth. Um, so we begin to see how all of those things, all of those elements constrain love. So we have to see these characters, I, I believe we're going to have to see these characters overcome their sensibility, their sense, their egos or whatever, in order to um, truly realize what they have in their life and what they can have with these people so um, i'm really excited to keep on reading see where um, the relationships go with um, marianne and willoughby what she will discover about him if she's gonna like him or anything because like i said 
Eleanor already told Marianne that Colonel Brandon has a a deep connection. Not a connection, but he, he really, really likes her. So uh, I want to see where that's going to go. And yeah, so till next time, peace.